One of the great advantages of St. Kitts and Nevis as a Caribbean vacation spot is their proximity to each other. St. Kitts and Nevis are separated by just two miles of water at the closest point. Welcome to Nevis Sun Tours and our Travel Tuesday video for this week. Today we present 7 ways to travel between St. Kitts and Nevis. Thank you for joining us. Traveling between St. Kitts and Nevis is one of the must-do activities, especially for travelers who want to truly have a full experience in this unique Caribbean country. We always ask the rhetorical question, why come to St. Kitts and Nevis? Have a chance to experience two distinctly different Caribbean islands without the hassle and not do so. Beyond that, I must tell you that you will love what you find when you go from one island to the next. They are so different. We promise we will do an upcoming video on that topic. In the meantime, here are 7 ways to travel between St. Kitts and Nevis. Number 1. By Public Ferry If you ever want to truly feel the heartbeat of a particular place and experience everyday life there, one of the best ways to do so is to take public transportation. You will overhear interesting conversations and have a few great chats yourself with the locals as they commute. Ultimately, you will get to your destination safely and make some new friends. That is the experience you can expect from traveling between St. Kitts and Nevis by public ferry. The public ferries serve mostly local travelers between the two islands who travel daily for work or personal business. These ferries travel between the towns of Bastia on St. Kitts and Charlestown on Nevis. Remember to check out the views as they go because they are absolutely stunning. And since we are giving reminders, Please remember to give this video a like and to subscribe to our channel. It helps tremendously and keeps us going as we provide videos like these every Tuesday. Number 2. By Water Taxi The water taxi is the most popular way for visitors to St. Kitts and Nevis to go between the two islands. This is the case for a few reasons. Inbound travelers to Nevis typically have their pre-arranged transfers booked by Nevis Sun Tours using this option. It is the most convenient route as the scheduled times are more frequent than by other means and the water taxis are also available on demand. Additionally, they take an average of 6 minutes to go from one island to the next as they cross the short distance between the two islands. They go from Oli Beach on Nevis to Cockershell Bay on St. Kitts. Number 3. By a sea bridge. We always have a good chuckle on the inside when we mention the sea bridge. It is not a bridge, but a car ferry service. That is why we laugh. The name is typical of the local Caribbean humor. Although it is a logical name, it bridges the gap across the sea. The sea bridge is a service which facilitates people who want to take their vehicles from one island to the other. It is convenient for that reason. It is a drive-on, drive-off service which makes it easy for travelers to drive the roads of both islands and explore. Number 4. By swimming. Yes, we said swimming. Obviously, it is not for everyone and we do not encourage it every day. In fact, we recommend it only once per year in March and only if you are registered for the Nevis to St. Kitts Cross Channel Swim. This is a competitive open water swimming activity with a course which covers the two miles between Oli Beach, Nevis and Cockershell Bay on St. Kitts. All swimmers who complete the event make it to St. Kitts from Nevis. So we count it as one of the seven ways to travel between St. Kitts and Nevis. Number 5. By Catamaran there is traveling to commute to a particular destination and there is traveling which ends up in a destination. With the latter, the final destination is irrelevant because the trip is all about the journey. We think this is an apt way to describe traveling between St. Kitts and Nevis via a catamaran. It is about the fun and enjoyment during the round trip, but it does count as a way to travel between St. Kitts and Nevis. Number 6. By dive boat. There is good diving in the waters around St. Kitts and Nevis. Technically, divers will not necessarily touch the land when they leave one island on a dive boat for the purpose of diving. What they will likely do is dive in the waters just off the coast of the other island, but we will count it as being on the other island for the purpose of this Nevis Sun Tours Travel Tuesday video. And now, our final way to travel between St. Kitts and Nevis. Number 7. By Flying In our video 7 Facts About Flying Into St. Kitts and Nevis, we shared that St. Kitts and Nevis has two airports, one on each island. 
But there is one additional fact you should know about these two airports. There are few flights between the two of them. So while it is possible to fly between the two, the opportunities are not frequent and we have had to arrange a helicopter service from Nevis to Sinkets for a client in the past. This was a client who preferred not to take a water taxi or any other means of transportation to get to the airport on St. Kitts. This was not a problem for us at Nevis Sun Tours. Our reach and connections were sufficient to confirm the arrangements. It is now time for today's point of value, where we tell you how you can use your newfound knowledge about St. Kitts and Nevis to your benefit, or if you're a travel advisor to your client's benefit, and for your ease of selling and booking Caribbean vacations to St. Kitts and Nevis. Number 8. Plan your travel between St. Kitts and Nevis according to how you want to enjoy the islands. We always encourage visits to both islands by those who travel here, and based on all the ways we have shared, you can see that there are ample hassle-free options. Just pick your choice. A Nevis Sun Tours vacation package naturally includes ways to enjoy both islands. We love helping visitors find the best ways to enjoy our islands and moving from one island to the other is among the experiences we love to share. That is why we have a day trip experience to each island included as options in our packages. We also love the fact that you chose to join us today for another Nevis Sun Tours Travel Tuesday video. Join the conversation in the comments below and let us know which way to travel between Sinkets and Nevis intrigues you the most. We also welcome your questions there or on our website at nevisuntours.com. Until next time, happy Travel Tuesday.